Hey guys, it's the Double Chan Show. It's Mike. It's Dan. What's up, guys? Well, we both love karaoke, and oh yeah, we're not good. Uh, no, we're not. <laughs> <laughs> but we love to go, and we really prefer the Asian style karaoke, where you get your own private room that you can kind of goof around with your friends. Yeah, you can get some food. They're really not that good, but you can get some tasty bubble tea. It's really fun. Yeah, but every time we go. We notice that there are different types of people. That's right. And they sing in different styles. That's right. So guys, we're gonna tell you all about the different types of karaoke singers today. Check it out. Number one, the professional. These people are seasoned karaoke veterans. Their song list they refer to as their repertoire, and they even know how to mess with the sound system. Karaoke is no joke for these guys. <laughs> So I want Christina Aguilera, I Turn To You, Level 5 Music, No Vocal Assist, and C Minor. Let's rock. Number two, the song hijacker. We all have that friend who comes running over whenever you start singing a song and say, Hey, I love that song, can I sing it with you? And you say yes, but by verse two, they're basically stealing your song. These people have no sense of karaoke etiquette. Oh my god, I love this song. I'm gonna sing with you. Okay, okay, okay. Number three, the throwback. These guys are living in the past. They only seem to know songs that were popular during their grandparents' era. And somehow they're surprised that you don't know any of them. We get it, you like old songs, but karaoke should be fun for everyone. So you guys want to do Folsom Prison Blues, uh, Johnny Cash? What? Uh, father and Son, Cat Stevens? Father, father who? Uh, Brown Eyed Girl, Van Morrison? What? Taylor Swift? Yay! Number four, The Annoying Couple, AKA The Duetters. Me? No, no, not you. Anyone but you. I don't do that. Yeah, okay. Can you guys put on a whole new world? Yeah, it's our song. Oh my god, it's the best ever. I know, remember they played in our first date? Yes, and your sparkly oh. eyes are just like Jasmine's. Oh my gosh, you were handsome just like Aladdin. Tell me I'm your Aladdin. Oh, I you are my Hey, you guys don't understand our love. Number five, the humble bragger or humble singer. Now these people are actually pretty good singers. You want to come off as arrogant or show off -y. So after they sing a song, which is usually done pretty well, they always have an excuse. Oh my god, guys, I'm so sorry. That totally sucked. I was not on my best game today. See, I ate a lemon this morning and it totally screwed my voice up. It did not sound as good as I wanted to. So sorry guys, I had to endure that. Number six, the sneaky one. There's always someone in a group that you might not think are good karaoke singers, but they have the voice of an angel. And it's usually the person in the group that's more shy or more awkward, maybe more or nerdy, but they can hit that note. Number seven, that takes it way too seriously. Basically, if you're the type of person that can't stand people laughing, singing, have a jolly good time, and you want to turn it into like a competition, rigid, follow the rules kind of thing, dude, you went twice already. Cheryl is next then ye, and then me, okay? Everybody better get in line. Number eight, the anti-social one. I mean, why do you even come out to karaoke if you're not gonna answer that with the group? If you're not gonna sing, at least order some food. Don't just sit in the corner. Cheryl, it's your turn. Uh, it's okay, I'm checking my Instagram. Cheryl, it's your turn. It's okay guys, I'm playing Candy Crush. Sweet. Hey Cheryl, it's your turn. It's, it's okay, I'm checking my stock portfolio. Number nine, the shy one. And you know we've all got one of these in the group, right? Number 10, the muncher. The muncher is there to socialize and to eat, but they won't sing for fear of public humiliation because they really can't sing. And whatever they're asked to sing, somehow their mouth is always full. Yeah. I'm gonna blow you guys with blank spaces right after I finish this chicken wing. Save it for me. Oh, skip me for now, but after these fries, 
part of your world, you guys are gonna love it. I'm an expert. I almost recorded a soundtrack for them. <laughs> hmm, can you put on John Legend all of me? I sound just like him. I gotta finish my icy first. Tapioca. Number 11, the dancer or party people. This person usually stands in the corner the whole time and just boogies, cause probably they can't really sing. Mike, you're next. Yeah, oh, yeah. I'm jamming to this beat. This is shit. And if you put more than one of these together, they become the party people. Hey guys, you wanna, you wanna sing? No, we're cool right here. No, it's okay, we're good. Number 12, the crier. We've all been this person, right? At some point in our lives, we went through some really emotional events and we're just channeling that through our horribly modified songs. <laughs> Number 13, the newbie. This person thinks that they're gonna sound amazing for their first time at karaoke. Why not? Because they sing great in the shower every day, right? However, they're in for a rude awakening. Guys, thanks again for inviting me. By the way, I sound really good. You are my fire, the one desire. We are two guys, uh, worlds apart. Um, something's wrong with the mic? I swear I sound better than this. Cause I want it that way. Guys, oh, seriously, is this how I sound in real life? And finally, number 14, the happy-go-lucky person. This guy or gal can't sing, their voice is cringeworthy, but they love to express themselves and have a good time. There's a castle in Wow, so that, <laughs> that was something. Yeah, that wasn't like real life at all. Well, no, no, <laughs> that's actually how we sound in real life, actually. Yeah. He's really good, Cheryl's unexpectedly good, yep. and we're horrible. That's right. Cheryl was the uh, came out of nowhere girl, he is like the professional. I, hey, no, this video does not accurately represent me. Come on. I was asked Come to on. play all the ugly roles. I was, <laughs> she's really good, she's really like a singer. Really we were good. all the newbies at one point, yep. the guys are tone deaf, we can't sing. But, you know, we enjoy it, because that's what karaoke should be. I'll tell you guys this, why I love Asian karaoke more than Western karaoke, yes, there is a difference. Yep. Because Western karaoke plays usually you go, you sing in front of a crowd of people. Like, who likes that? Yeah. I mean, we like to just stay. Maybe I do. <laughs> really? <laughs> nah, you like to do this way, Ben. Hey. You prefer no, the they, Asian karaoke. Yeah, you suck. Both, you maybe. suck. So you're only your friends now. Yeah. Them. And yeah, we right. all support each other in that's this right. really great environment. Yeah. Like, except for you scream at us. That's kidding. Nah. <laughs> except, for, except for you guys are actually really good and you guys make us look bad, but we don't care because we're all like just enjoying it. At least we're in, the, in one room, yeah. not in front of like, a whole crowd of people. And I'll tell you guys why else I love Asian karaoke. Usually you go to the places and they uh, allow you to order enough food and drinks to match your price of admission. That's right. So whatever you're yeah. paying, like we're paying like a hundred bucks, whatever, for three hours, then we get a hundred dollars worth of food and drinks. They're overpriced, but still, we get something. Yeah, that's good stuff. And you always need a good drink to carry you through. That's right. And there's Chinese and English songs. Korean too. Oh and yeah. Japanese. And Japanese. What? Japanese. We appreciate you guys so much for coming out to do this that's with right. us. Don't forget to uh, check out Cheryl's channel. Yes. We'll put her information in the description box. Let us know what type of karaoke singer you are and if we left off anything. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching. See you next Bye. time! See ya!